begin. <laughs> Sam. So, Bertie, whatever colour paper you've chosen, if you could lay your paper down from corner to corner, on, on just two of the corners, you need to fold that in with the coloured side on the outside. Now all you do is just open it up and just gently rub that down so that it's easier to fold this next bit. What you now need is a guiding line to mark the centre of this point here. So to do that, you just line the, these two opposite corners and gently pinch in on that line. Can you just show for a second, please? Fold right, these two bits, these two opposite corners, in and along this line here. There. Mm -hmm. So what we have now is what you can see there, like an ice cream cone. Mm -hmm. You can turn that over because we are going to be moving it again. So you're just doing it really just to so that it's opened. <laughs> <laughs> I do press it down. It seems, Kerry seems to, seems to have inverted itself. <laughs> back so that ends on the side edge here you see this got a line here and you've got a, that white line there yeah. where this this line here you press that down all the way down to the foot try try not over over this bit here from this corner you see where this orange bit here you'll have a corner here and imagine a line going meet from this corner to that corner there. Down there. So you do that on the other side as well. I don't think oh. I'm making a shoe anymore. What's your shoe look like, Rory? I think um, I've done mine wrong. Some, somewhere along the line, me. something went okay. very, very So, wrong. now oh, the next, like the next move is to do that exact move. same thing again. You can see how it's going to work. With this Rory, what you've edge. made is a Geno Starfighter, isn't it? You basically, yeah. what you need is a line almost exactly right down the middle from this edge and that edge. Okay. And what that will do oh. is bring these over each other. Make sure you don't go beyond. <laughs> making sure you... Oh, it's beginning to look almost like a shoe. <laughs> it it very looks like a handbag. <laughs> it's a handbag to go with the shoe. Oh. <laughs> it's a direct correlation between distance from Sam and ability, I think. <laughs> What you should have is something that looks like that. You fold them down again and you've got that. What you want to do is you turn this over so that it goes over, but the actual point is slightly over that that line that you you've lined your shoe up with. It, it does sort of find its own uh, place because of all the all the folds that you made at the top makes the kind of a little space for you to do that fold. So that's exactly on that line. You've got your shoe like that, and you you're opening it out like that. Okay. I've never went to Berlin. Oh, I'm confused. Here, just so that it's all nice and equal. And what you've got is that sort of thing there. Yeah. Exactly, Lucy's got it. Yeah. 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 Sorry. Okay. I think my paper's has got it. You've got it like that. You've got it like that. Open it up. Okay. Right, so what you're doing now, what you're, all you're doing now is making this look nice. Taking this bit from the underside of the shoe, so you've got the, there you go, so you've got, and then you'll see what that's done to the front of the shoe, it's sort of, you should already have this happening, where it naturally wants to go in on itself there. Please with yourself. No. I think, to be honest, because neither of you have really done the heel very nicely. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> but, Ma <laughs> but Michaela has actually finished it off nicely, so I'm giving this one to Michaela, second is Laura.